Hey up everybody, hope you're all good. I know we've had an amazing weekend. <coughs> I've just been eating wasabi. Peas again. <coughs> yeah, I went up. I said on one of my last videos that this lady, a subscriber, had sent me loads of uh, VIP nuts. Because I'm a VIP. And they're gorgeous. But I'm on a diet. And I can't, the thing, oh Jesus. It gets up your nose, wasabi. But you can't stop eating them. Right, oh, just one more. Oh, Jesus Christ. I got a drink. <laughs> oh shit. Oh god. You know when you just get that right bit of wasabi and it just goes right up back of your nose. Oh. I want to stick to other flavours. They've got all really nice flavours like uh, hot hot toffee, that's gorgeous that. I mean, I've got wasabi in my pissing eye now. It's a disaster. It's pandemonium in the van. And I'm in a car park. And there's somebody there. That I probably, they probably just think I'm FaceTiming. Anyway. I hope you're all alright. I'm just waiting for my daughter to... I had to stop recording then. Because this couple had pulled up and they were stood right at so they got out of the car, they were going at gym, they were like gym people. But you know ones with skin tight lycra and everything. I was just getting distracted. They'd not see me. I'm sat here. <laughs> I don't know what they were just there ages. Anyway, so we're going to Bridlington with the uh my mum and my dad and my sister and my nephew. It's gonna be great. And we're going to go to Kite Festival. So hopefully I'll get some good footage. I hope you enjoy it. Oh, and get subscribing because, as I said, is it down there, subscribe? It's, one, it's down, it's one more at corner, subscribe it. It turns out, when I said I talked in the last video about people thinking you've got to pay to subscribe, loads of people have said that. They said, oh, I thought you had to pay. You don't, it doesn't cost you to subscribe. It just means you see my videos when the, a new one comes up. Or you see them more often. So I'll do that because it helps me out and I appreciate that. Alright, enjoy this video. Well it's a beautiful day and I'm here with the family. The family. Am. Family. I've got my sister, Woo! the golden child, <laughs> and my mum. <laughs> my mum don't want to be on camera. I'll probably have to edit I didn't it know all the that. Video, you know, he's got and, a camera in his. <laughs> and I've got I've got two two naughty children in a in a beach trolley. Oh, and we've got the dog. Lottie, say the, hello. The infamous. We've not brought the barber jacket. The infamous barber wearing. Morning. Morning. So we're just going to head up Jen, to the cliff. Video. Yeah, this is going to be my next video. Do you want to be on it? Edward's the biggest fan. Edward's my biggest fan, he's going to be on it. And then uh, we'll be joined by my dad later. He's had a lion. <laughs> it's absolutely <laughs> glorious. <laughs> so I'll introduce my Yay! beautiful, amazing. I don't know, can you see us on that? I don't know. I can't see us. This is my amazing sister. Hello! And I've persuaded the golden child. She's the golden <laughs> child. Now I tell you, qualified pilot, qualified financial advisor, there's nothing she can't do. Isn't the kid? Well. Very yeah. proud of my sister. Absolutely. Rightly so. I'm, I'm the black sheep. <laughs>
made it to the pub. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Mum. Cheers. Cheers. What are you drinking? Lime and soda. Cheers. What are you got, Dad? Um, Mucky beer. Mucky beer. Mucky Cheers, beer. Dad. Cheers. <laughs> so I've got him to the pub. <laughs> He's been trying to persuade us all day. I've tried him to the pub. the last two hours and we found it here. Yeah. And I'm even going to persuade him to maybe have some fish and chips. That's going to be very hard. You're going to have to put my arm behind the back. Yeah. My arm behind the back for that. Seagulls will have them. Um, you fetch kids to the seaside one day. What do they want to do? Go in shops? That's all they want to do, go in shops. What shop do you want to go in? The works. <laughs> they want to win nobles. Go win nobles. Where are you walking? It's shop works. Looking how much I've caught. Is that my face red? I've caught some today. Oh, I'm so tired. I've had an amazing day, it's been great. I've, I've just drove all the way back from Brid and I've dropped my daughter off, and it were a bit of a nightmare coming back in all traffic. Because weather's been that good this weekend, I think everybody's gone to Bridlington. So I've got a spot where I park up uh, just down here, so I'm going to just pull up here for night. It's not brilliant. It's fairly quiet, but you do get odd boy race, but a lot of the time. I just want to get my head down. But I want to get something to eat, chill chill out for a bit and get my head down. And I'm back to work tomorrow. It's alright here. There's some houses, there's always a few cars parked up. But it is a bit early tonight. What time is it? It's only 8 o'clock. I normally park up quite late. I got myself this from Alfred's. It's probably not best security, but it's a sort of deterrent a little bit, isn't it? There's no else I can do, is there? Let's just get in. Quite a few cars about. Chuffing state at van. Vans are rated, by the way. I hope you can see me alright. See, one of the realities of having in such a small van is when you've got all stuff piled up, it's a right bloody tip. Because I've got like, all my daughter's stuff. Which I need to drop off at my unit. <sighs> I need my laptop because I've got some uh, a couple of uh, emails to reply to, urgent emails. And So for my supper, I've got a can of Desperados. I know I'm cutting down and being healthy, but it's Sunday, so it's technically weekend, so it don't count. I've got some onion barges. So I'm gonna have a couple of them. Just put them in Ridge Monkey. And then I'll 
answer these emails and probably watch a film so I don't know we'll see might watch some YouTube how long do you reckon onion barges take? I only want two of them just squash them down smell good bloody stupid thing so I've got two burnt onion barges get them oh. can't be Yeah, I don't know if... I'm, I know other people have said the same with these stoves. Can't turn them down, so it's either red hot or off. So when you're doing stuff like that, you're just burning all the time. So, them onion barges were a bit spicy. But it's filled and all. I'm just going to chill out for a bit. Watch a bit of YouTube. It's been a good... Good day today at Kite Festival. Uh, I bumped into a few subscribers as well, which were really cool. And it made me feel right good because I was with my mum and dad and my sister. And uh, yeah, so hello all the people that I were talking to. Do you know what? I didn't think to get your names and I should have. See, that's why Ellen's good at that sort of stuff because she remembers people's names. I'm useless. But, you know, hello. <laughs> Hope you had a good time at Bridlington. Uh, yeah, so what are we up to this week? We did that, uh, I'll tell you what we'll talk about. Let's talk about getting a bigger van and this, this is why I'm getting, well, it's one of the reasons we're getting a bigger van because this, when I'm ever in, I'm in my van, I'm hunched over all the time and it's not good for my posture at all. So I'm going to look at some this week. I know vans are expensive at the moment. Uh, I'm fancying probably a Transit Peugeot box, uh, Citroen Relay, Fiat Ducato, that type. I really would have liked a Luton, a big Luton van, but it's just not practical, you know, when you're going to supermarkets and stuff like that. Uh, and it's, we're going to sell this van and, uh, and we're doing it together, me and Helen. So we're sort of going 50-50 on it. And uh, yeah, very excited about it. I want to look at some next week. I've got a Peugeot, no, it's a Fiat Ducato I've got to look at. And that's got really low mileage. So, but you know, I hate buying cars and vans and stuff like that. You're always a bit wary, aren't you? God, it's warm in here. Got a dab on. Bought myself a fan from the uh, one below shop it was five pound it's all right put that on but you know as we get these heat waves i'm probably gonna have to get a few a few different uh fans you'll not be able to hear me talk now because of that oh it's nice oh It's just, at weekend, you know, with diet, I'm not going over at top at weekend. So, going to be strict dieting at week, then at weekend, that's why I've got a can of beer. And then obviously when I do chips with Helen, we'll be pigging out. But I think, you know, it's about having a happy medium, isn't it? And this is instead of a pudding. I'd usually have a pudding or chocolate, so, you know. It's a lot better than that, isn't it? And you, you know when you're drinking? So, look, I can't drink. 
Look at that. It's bloody ridiculous. A few people have said where you're going to live while you're doing Van up. But I'm just going to live in Van as I'm doing it up. I only need a mattress and a stove, really, and my toilet, so I can be moving stuff around in it as I'm doing it. So I don't, I don't think that's going to be difficult, especially with it being summer and everything. And yeah, I will be definitely having a diesel eater. I'll be doing all that myself. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, I don't know, I'm not putting any jammers on. I can't be bothered, I'm too tired. Oh, oh I'm not turning the lights off. Oh, you can't see me now, can you? I don't even know if you can see me. So anyway... Morning. I don't know if any of you are like me, it takes me ages to come round in the morning. It really does. And I slept quite heavy. When I eventually got to sleep, <coughs> I slept quite heavy. And I was dreaming about that I was living in uh, some mountains in caves with like a load of hippies part of a commune don't know what that means they were all really nice people but it was a funny dream because we were in the middle of nowhere miles away from civilization in this mountain range but then we went to Morrison's for us uh, I'm even dreaming about supermarkets what's all that about oh. anyways <laughs> you won't believe stay to this van it's a right tip I need to sort this out today as well. And oh, that's a good view, isn't it? It's not as sunny as it was yesterday. You know, as you get older, I, oh god, I don't. I don't possess a mirror anymore. Well, there's a little one about what Ellen uses. The only time I see myself is when I'm filming these bits. Get to see all my bags and everything, my chins. Oh. <coughs> Wanna go out have a, a lovely drive round Barnsley now. Calling Tesco's. Get something for when I can eat at 12 o'clock. Something healthy. I'm sure many of uh, local people will recognise where I am. I would really like your comments about what you want to see on videos. Tell me what you want and I can knock a video up about it. That would be interesting, wouldn't it? I've got a few in pipeline. But it's a bit it's a bit slow for me while uh, Helen's working these long shifts. Can't go on a trip with or anything, so... But let me assure you that we will be going on some more trips in the next few weeks. You're just going to have to put up with me until then. But it's my channel, anyway. I started it. So you can get away all that. Making out sheets star. Anyway, love you and leave you. I hope you've had a little bit of entertainment from this video. And I will see you for the next one, which will be in a few days. Which will probably... I'm, I think I'll record the money video. And I've got the Q&A with Helen to do. Because I messed it up when we went to the pub. So we're going to do that again. So I'm going to drive over one night. Just, just, you see, that's love, isn't it? 
and I'll drive all that way over just to see her for a couple of hours. Okay? From Barnsley to Sheffield, it's miles. Most people in Barnsley don't even go out of Barnsley, I'll tell you. Sheffield's like a foreign country. And especially with the uh, playoff final coming up next week. Oh, Barnsley versus Wednesdays. And I'm not even going to say which side I sit on. Because I've said that on these videos I'm not doing politics and I'm not going to do football either. But. <laughs> Anyway, it's a difficult one. No, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing football. I'm not doing it. So, yeah. Thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you all later. Adios.